Hello everybody, welcome to System Test 12 Series 4. Let's go ahead and get started. Right up here for the first notification appliance, we have a Simplex 4901-9820 horn on the 4903-9101 strobe plate. The horn and the strobe are powered separately, and so the strobe will continue to flash when I silence the system. And right here for the second notification appliance, we have a uh, my Wheelock 3424 behind the Space Age AV32. The horn and the light are tied together, so and they will be doing two-wire operation. By the way, the knacks are coded to March time. Down here for the first conventional pull station, you haven't seen this pull station in a while. This is the my Siemens XMS501. And right here for the second conventional pull station, we have the Simplex 4251-20 underneath the stopper. And the voice of act today will be doing this high low tone and the voice message is, is, is enabled. May I have your attention please? May I have your attention please? We will be setting off the life and safety system at this time. Please disregard all signals at this time until further notice. There is no need to evacuate. Again, there is no need to evacuate. Thank you. Oh, I forgot to mention, I will not be silencing and resetting from the panel today. So... We're gonna go ahead and close this. And so, well, what am I silencing and resetting it from? Or are you getting ready to find out? Here is the main addition of this system test. I now have an LCD2-80 enunciator. And I will be acknowledging and silencing and resetting from the enunciator today. And I will also do a fire drill on the enunciator later on. Since we haven't done the SK Pool S in the Series 4 system test video today, we are going to go ahead and do that first. Headphone users, please turn down your volume. Everybody ready? In 3, 2, 1. our four wire audible silence on the 4903-9101 as well as the SPSR speaker strobe. Now we can just go ahead and press system reset. All right now we will re-alarm again with the Siemens XMS501 in three, two, one. and we will re-alarm once more with the Simplex 4251-20. Here we go. Three, two, one. Unless directed 
to do so by the proper authorities. And to reset the XMS501, all I'm gonna do is take my Siemens T45 key, insert it like this, turn it, and it pops back up just like that. All right, now you can just go ahead and hit system reset. We will be re-alarming the system once again by activating the SK Photo W and the SK Photo Classic with a magnet. So first up, I'm going to do the SK Photo W in three, two, one. Okay, now we're we are alarm once more with the K Photo Classic. And to reset them, all we're going to do is we're going to hit System Reset. Okay, we will not be activating the Agent Release today. We will be activating the Supervisory today because there is something that I want to show you on the system. This is something new I recently added. See, up above here, I have my MDL3R Sync Module. And coming up here... It leads to control modules. This one is powering the um, sounder on the test station. And this one is controlling the alarm indicator. Now, this one is set to non-silenceable. So when the system is silenced, the alarm LED on the test switch will remain lit. And this is a new feature that I have just added. You're getting ready to see it in action. Let's go ahead and activate the test switch. Here we go. Three, two, one. And as you see on the LCD-280, the supervisory LED lit up when I activated the duct detector key switch. And as you see right here, the alarm LED remains lit while the piezo is silenced. And here's the alarm indicator control module that is still active. Now all that's done, we're just going to hit system reset. 
All right, and before I end the video, I'm going to do a quick fire drill on the LCD 2-80. So all I'm going to do is hold, hold down this button right here beside the label where it says fire drill. So, here we go. Three, two, one. Just reset the system. Attention in the building, attention in the building. We have finished testing the life and safety system at this time. If you hear any signals from this point forward, please obey them. Again, if you hear any signals from this point forward, please obey them. Thank you and I hope you all have a nice day. Okay, well this is going to conclude system test number 12, series four, everybody. This video was requested by Lights, locks, and alarms, so special shout out to him. If you would like to, you may leave a comment down below on what you think of the video, and I will see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day, everybody.